Hello, if you're interested in having your student log in on a personal computer, I would recommend using the Google Chrome browser. So I'm going to open up that Google Chrome browser. Um, you can see I'm logged into this browser using a bunch of different, different accounts. Um, but here I would just click that add account and I would sign in to Google Chrome. Uh, your student has an email address to the district. It is usually your first initial, your last name, um, the last two digits of your student ID, and then we do at mlsdk12.org. Um, on student Chromebooks, sometimes the at mlsdk12.org isn't there, so you need to make sure your student knows to put that. So most of the time, again, it's first initial, last name, and last two digits of the ID at MLSDK12. Next, you're going to go ahead and put in the password, and then you are into the Google account. Um, it says I'm already here, so I'm going to go ahead and switch to that account. This is my daughter's account. And once you're in the Google Chrome browser, you can see that any extensions should be there, any password should be there. Um, so if your student wants to use a specific um, app or site, it probably can be logged in via the Clever app. Uh, they possibly might have it bookmarked, or they can just add the uh, URL in the top uh, Omnibox. So hope that helps your students log in to personal devices using their Google account.